Welcome to another RSR. Tonight I am predicting the 2024 CONCACAF Caribbean Cup. Prediction de la Copa Carabana de la CONCACAF 2024. It starts tomorrow night. We see who of these 10 teams, the three that go to the Champions Cup, the one who rules the roost, Champions Curse has already taken effect because Robin Hood couldn't even make it out of the CFU Club Shield. Cavaliers still there. Arnett Gardens, Grenades come in. Robin Hood gone. Cavalier, the runners-up, are there. Do they have a clear line to do one better than last year? Let's find out. In my book, let's find out. Fifth place in Group A. Well, Group A, we have Cavalier FC, Arnett Gardens FC, Mount Pleasant FA, Miscellaneous Police FC, Real Hope FA, Real Hope from Haiti, Miscellaneous Police from Trinidad, Cavalier Mount Pleasant, and Arnett Gardens from Jamaica. So we got three Jamaican teams in one group. One of them will... One of them will come up short because, in my opinion, Real Hope FA... I don't see them beating any of these teams. I think they get one point. Police FC does as well. I think Real Hope and Police FC finish fourth and fifth. Fifth and fourth, to be exact. I think Arnett Gardens will put up a fight, but they came through the shield. Mount Pleasant, Cavalier were top two in the JPL last year. And to me, I think it's going to be another one of those one-two type finishes. Mount Pleasant finishing second. Cavalier finishing first. Cavalier the defending Runners up in this tournament, figuring out a way to finish top of that group. Mount Pleasant don't have enough CONCACAF experience, even though they're playing two teams they already know and two other teams that they should be able to beat. They'll still slip up against Cavalier, I think. Which means top of the group, Cavalier, Mount Pleasant second, Arnett Gardens, just a sad miss out third, Police and Real Hope, fourth and fifth, far out, no hope. For them, huh? Group B. We have Molka FC, the third place team from 2023. Saval FC, both of the Dominican Republic. AC Port of Spain of Trinidad. Uwanaminthe of Haiti and Grenades FC from the Club Shield. Fifth place is Grenades FC in my book. They played well at the Club Shield. They got some pretty good win. Out of that knockout tournament. And they got to the final. They're here. But I don't think they're going to go full Robin Hood. I don't think so. They're going to be more like Golden Lion than Robin Hood. And you could say that Arnett Gardens is more Robin Hood. But they still didn't make the knockout stage. Because there's just so much little room for error here. But Grenades is going to be Golden Lion. They're going to get stomped. Uwana Minthe, Sabal Mocha, Port of Spain are all better. Fourth place, Uwana Minthe FC. Third place, AC Port of Spain in third place for me. I think Mocha and Sabal are better. I think the Dominican League is better than the Trinidadian League, in my opinion. Port of Spain didn't get out of the group last year either. Mocha did. Robin Hood did. One even Sabal. Two Jamaican teams got through groups. Right. So, Port of Spain, I think they're going to have another moment like last year. Just miss out. Second place, Mocha FC. Yes, they were the third place team last year. I think Sabal's just a bit better. They've bounced back a little bit. No Pantoja. No Robin Hood. I think Sabal's bounced back a little bit. I think they're going to finish first in this group, but Mocha still gets to the knockout stages. Sabal finishing first. Which means you have the Group A winner versus the B runner-up. Group B winner versus the A runner-up in the semifinals. It's that simple because there's only four teams. Semifinal one, Cavalier FC of Jamaica versus Mocha FC of the Dominican Republic. And I got Cavalier winning. Mocha played Robin Hood last time, lost. They also barely beat Harborview. I think Cavalier is better than both Robin Hood and Harborview. Mocha is probably better at this point, but 
I still think Cavalier, they know how to get to the final. That's not the question. The question is, is can they win the final? Cavalier makes the final for the second straight year. They have a chance at redemption in my book. Mocha to the third place game. Semi-final two. Cibao FC of the Dominican Republic versus Mount Pleasant FA of Jamaica. Cibao. Cibao's bounce back. I'm not too worried about what we can expect to see from them. I don't think they're going to falter this time. I just don't see it. Sabal to the final, Mount Pleasant to the third place game. So the third place game is the same situation as last year. Mocha FC versus a Jamaican team who isn't Cavalier, right? Who isn't that big team. A team who did play well, but isn't that big team. Mount Pleasant FA versus Mocha. And I say Mocha does it again. I think they pull... Same color scheme, too, as Harborview. I think they pull it. I think Mocha does it again. They win the third place game. They hold firm from last year. They hold serve from last year. They move on to the Champions Cup by winning the third place game. The final, Cavalier FC of Jamaica versus Cibao FC of the Dominican Republic. And Cavalier loses again. Cibao is going to be your CONCACAF Caribbean Cup champions because... I just have a feeling Sibau is going to do enough at home that they're going to beat Cavalier. Sort of similar to Robin Hood, but not exactly. This is one where Cavalier isn't obviously a champion. This is one where this could go either way. This is one where Cavalier should have done it last year, right? And you want revenge. And I think it's going to be so much in their head that they want redemption that sometimes it doesn't go your way. You could beat Toronto FC in 2017 and get your redemption and do it pretty damn easily. You could also be, I don't know, the Philadelphia Eagles, right? And just absolutely collapse at the worst time possible looking for revenge. I know we're talking about a different sport here, but whatever, right? Whatever. The, the Eagles had a horrible season last year. Sabal wins the Caribbean Cup. There you go. So, Sabal, your champions of the 24 Caribbean Cup in my predictions. I'm going to go there. I'm going to go there. I may be wrong, but if it ends up being the final, be interesting to see. But we'll re-predict the knockouts before we get there. Whatever happens. Hard because there's a lot of room, no room for error actually, so it might be totally different. Who knows? But my predicted CONCACAF Champions Cup teams are Cibao FC as the champions, Cavalier retaining the runners-up spot, and Mocha FC retaining the third place spot. So everything's the same, except instead of a unknown, unexpected Surinamese team winning the tournament. We have a Dominican Republic team coming back to form, winning the tournament over the runners-up of last year. It's the same, same, but different, right? With that being said, if you like this video, like it, share, subscribe, you know what it is, tell your friends, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell notification you want to subscribe, send some chats on the live streams, comment on this video, put us to play this, share friends and family, all that great stuff. I'll see you tomorrow for the first game. We're actually doing a triple again. How fun. Starting with Cavalier, Mount Pleasant versus Cavalier. That Mount Pleasant Cavalier game goes first. We'll see if my predictions are right, at least in Group A, pretty much right off the bat. Pretty much. Or at least portionally of it. But we'll find out. We're first live for Cavalier Mount Pleasant. Then second will be live for Ralistelli versus Saprisa. We'll be live for Alawalense versus Alianza. We'll review Alianza Alawalense. Then on Wednesday, we will be live for both League's Cup semifinals. We have Columbus versus Philly. Then, LAFC versus Colorado. We'll review LAFC Colorado. Thursday, semifinal recap for the League's Cup. Friday, League's Cup final prediction. Saturday, Houston versus Toronto. Toronto's back. Yay. But, hey, maybe they'll build off it. Who knows? And then Sunday, the League's Cup third place and final. Two lives, one review. That's all this week has. League's Cup coming to a close. 
Toronto FC is returning. We got some more CONCACAF games that we actually get to cover for once because we have some open time to do it. Another triple. There you go. With that being said, I'll see you later. I'm Ryan and I'm out. Peace. See you.